Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, we can write this when we have a is to power m plus n. Do same thing as a is to power m times a is to power n. And this here we have a raised to power x times a raised to power 1 n plus a raised to power x equals to 40 here. And this here we have a raised to power x common. I will factor it out. We have 8 raised to the power x into bracket. 8 raised to the power 1 left here, which is 8 plus. Here we have 1 left here, close bracket, equals to 40 from here. At this, here we have 8 raised to the power x times 8 plus 1, that's 9, and equals to 40 on this side. Next step here, divide both sides by 9. Let's divide this side by 9. Also, divide this side by 9. Here, yeah, 9 cancelled each other. We have 8 raised to the power x equals to 10 over 9. Sorry, this is 40. 40 over 9. Then, next step, we take the log on both sides. Now, this here we have log 8 raised to the power x equals to log 40 over 9. And from here, we apply the power law of logarithm. When we have log m raised to power p, this is the same thing as p log m. That is, here we have x log 8 equals to log 40 over 9. And next step here, we also apply the law of logarithm. When we have log a over b, this is the same thing as log a minus log b that is here we have x log 8 equals to log 40 minus log 9 then next step here divide both side by log 8 that is divide this side by log 8 also divide this side by log 8 that is here log 8 cancelled each other and we have x equals to, we separate this into two fractions. This becomes log 40 over log 8 minus log 9 over log 8. Then, next step here, we can express 40 as 8 times 5, and which implies here we have x equals to log 8 times 5. 5 over log 8 minus log 9 over log 8. Then next step here, this follows the log logarithm. When we have log 8 times b, I write this as log a plus log b. That is, what we have becomes x equals to log 8 plus log 5 over log 8 minus log 9 over log 8. The next step here, separate this into two fractions. We have x equals to log 8 over log 8 plus log 5 over log 8 minus log 9 over log 8. Then, from what we have here, log 8 cancelled each other. We have 1 left, which implies x equals to 1 plus log 5 over log 8 minus log 9 over log 8. That is, from here, also, we can write 8 as 2 times 2 times 2, which is 2 raised to power 3, and also, 9 as 3 times 3, which is 3 squared. And what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 5 over log 2 raised to power 3 minus log 3 squared over log 2 raised to power 3. Then we apply the power of log 3 comes here, 
2 comes here and also 3 comes here. We have x now equals to 1 plus log 5 over 3 log 2 minus 2 log 3 over 3 log 2. Then, next step here, we can write this as x equals to 1 plus 1 over 3 times log 5 over log 2 minus 2 over 3 times log 3 over log 2. Then, we apply change of base here when we have log a over log b. This is the same thing as log a to base b. That is, here we have x equals to 1 plus 1 over 3 log 5 base 2 minus 2 over 3 log 3 base 2. Then here, we bring this together as some fraction. This is 1 over 1. We have x equals to the SCM here as 3. This becomes 3 plus log 5 base 2 minus 2 log 3 is 2. At this here we have the value of x here. Then let's check if this satisfies this given problem. At this, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 3 plus log 5 is 2. Minus 2 log 3 is 2 all over 3. That is what we have here becomes it's raised to power 3 plus log 5 is 2 minus 2 log 3 is 2 all over 3 plus 1 here. Then plus also it's raised to power. 3 plus log 5 base 2 minus 2 log 3 base 2 over 3. This is equal to 40 on this side. Then, here we can bring this as one fraction. Okay, 1 over 1 here, and we have 8 raised to the power SM log plus 3. And here we still have 3 plus log 5 base 2. Minus 2 log 3 base 2, then plus 3 here now, then plus. Also, here we have 8 raised to power 3 plus log 5 base 2 minus 2 log 3 base 2 over 3. This is equal to 40 on this side. Then here we have 3 plus 3 that's 6. This becomes 8 raised to power 6 plus log 5. Base 2 minus 2 log 3 base 2 all over 3 plus here we still have 8 raised to power 3 plus log 5 base 2 minus 2 log 3 base 2 then all over 3 this is equals to 40 on this side then next step we can write it as 2 raised to power 3 which is raised to the power 6 plus log 5 base 2 minus 2 log 3 base 2 all over 3 plus also here we have 2 raised to the power 3 which is raised to the power 3 plus log 5 base 2 minus 2 log 3 base 2 all over 3 this is equals to 40 on this side then this power multiplies 3 cancel each other. We have 2 raised to the power 6 plus log 5 is 2 minus 2 log 3 base 2 plus. Also here yeah, is cancelled each other. We have 2 raised to the power 3 plus log 5 is 2 minus 2 log 3 is 2. This is equal to 40 on this side. And we apply the law of indices here. And this becomes 2 raised to the power 6 times 2 raised to the power log 5 base 2 over 2 raised to the power 2 log 3 base 2 
plus also here we have 2 raised to power 3 times 2 raised to power log 5 raised to then over 2 raised to power 2 log 3 raised to is it equals to 40 on this side 2 raised to power 6 to multiply itself 6 times that gives us 64 then times this follows and we have a raised to power log b to base a which is equals to b here we have 5 then over here we first reverse this 2 up that's 3 square so this becomes 3 square which is 9 plus also this also 2 raised to power 3 that's 8 then times 5 over also 9 is it equals to 40 on this side that is 64 times 5 that's 320 then plus that's over 9 plus 8 times 5 that's 40 over 9 is it equals to 40 on this side then next step here bring this together as one fraction is sma that's 9 we have 320 plus 40 that's 360 then is equals to 40 on this side and 360 over 9 of course that's 40 this equals to 40 here we have left hand side equals to the right hand side and therefore we conclude that x equals to 3 plus log 5 base 2 minus 2 log 3 base 2 all over 3 satisfy this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell share this video give a thumbs up and put your comment See you next class and bye for now.